how to promote affiliate links using Google Docs. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can promote affiliate links using Google Docs. So let's get into it. Now, you might be wondering, how can you promote links using Google Docs? How do you share them? How can this entire process happen? Well, it's simple and easy, and I'm gonna tell you why I have chosen Google Docs as a format to promote my affiliate links. Well. First off, a lot of social media websites like Facebook. Facebook is one of my favorite places to promote affiliate links, but you know the issue with Facebook right now? Often, if you post affiliate links, they will block you. You will get blacklisted from a lot of groups. A lot of the time, they won't let you copy and paste affiliate links. So if I copy this link, sometimes, a lot of the times this happens that I'm going to paste an affiliate link. So I can just click on paste over here and I can just click on post. And sometimes my affiliate link will be posted and sometimes it won't. So right now it is being posted, but right now you can see it has been waited for the admin approval. Until it gets admin approval, I cannot get this posted. And this is happening a lot of different affiliate marketers. A lot of creators are facing this issue. And that is why I have a life hack where you can use Google Docs to promote your affiliate link. So you have to go on to your affiliate platform, whatever it might be. I am using Digistore24, you can use Clickbank, Bluehost, whatever affiliate marketing platform that you like to use. You're just going to take a look at your affiliate marketing platform and what you're going to do is you're going to take your affiliate and you're going to enter it in Google Docs and provide some value in your doc. So we're just going to click on blank over here on your Google Docs, open up a blank doc and then you can add the best weight loss book ever click here to get full access and what this kind of advertisement does is that it gives people the curiosity to search for your link so what you're going to do is this is a keto meal plan and i'm just going to copy this link and what i'm going to do is i'm going to hyperlink the text so what you're going to do is you're going to select the text and you're going to click on insert link and you're going to paste your affiliate link so i'm just going to paste your affiliate link it doesn't leave like long lists of links and what you can do is you can add more information about this as well don't make it too lengthy never go over like 15 lines for a google doc when you are creating a doc like this and you want to make sure that you know entices people people are left curiosity you don't want to say everything about the book or about the affiliate over here you want to provide them with the curiosity so when they click on the link over here they are actually going to be very very excited to see what is inside and they will be directly led to your product via your link so once you do that you can just save your doc so you can just save it like it is you're going to add the best weight loss book ever as the title and then you can go back onto your google docs and you can copy this doc and just share the link of the doc so what you're going to do is you can just take your link you can click on share and once you click on share on your google doc you're going to click on copy link and people with this link can only open this and change to anyone with links so uh, whoever opens this link can only be a viewer commenter or editor so i'm going to set this as only a viewer so i don't want people to be able to edit this people can only view this and what i like to do is i like to indirectly market it on facebook now now instead of having to add like um, a direct affiliate link i'm going to go search for keto on facebook i can go on facebook groups and then i can just go on to this group over here and then I can just post on it like directly so what I can do is I found a link to the best keto meal plan on Google Docs or on this docs and then what you're going to do is you're going to paste so we're just going to paste our Google Doc link over here. And the reason that you're pasting your Google Doc link is now if I just post this, I don't have to wait or get blocked or be removed from the group. It's going to be a simple and easy kind of post without having to wait for approvals and all that. And you can go on to Facebook comments as well. And you can see I'm hungry this morning and want cereal, not eggs, meat, etc. And what you can do is you can paste your link and then you can just add follow once you have pasted the link you can reply in your own comment and you can just write follow this plan for better results and less hunger they're just going to add this and what this will do is that not only people that posted this but all of the people that are within this group are interested in a keto diet when they see something that piques their interest which is not you know directly telling them 
everything they need to, you know, uh, feel like in, they know, they will be curious about the product or the affiliate and they will actually click on it. And that is the entire point of marketing. You don't want people to just be like, oh, I already know that. Uh, I don't need this. You want people to be curious about your product and search for it and guide themselves toward your product. And once you do that, you can do this on Facebook. And another great plan is to do it on YouTube. So just search for keto over here. And what you can do is you can see there are multiple different videos on keto. So let's say how to lose weight on keto. So let, let's search that how to lose weight on keto. And then you can see there are quite a few YouTubers. And what you can do is you can see I have this YouTuber over here. They make a lot of low carb recipes and stuff. And what you can do is you can go onto their videos, go into the comment section of their videos. And not only can you promote it in the comments, but you can show more. And you can take a look at their social media platforms or their business emails, and then you can email them about your discount or about your affiliate, and you can ask them to promote it in their next video. And a lot of the times you are going to be able to get a good deal. You can see this person already is doing a lot of different affiliates over here, and you can add your own as well. And instead of having like an affiliate, you can ask them to make a standalone video on the product that you are promoting. So it could be any range from here so you can see a lot of these are youtube courses uh home doctor books and uh, other affiliate offers whatever kind of offer it might be it is going to depend on the offer that you have that what kind of youtubers you are going to target and what kind of comment sections you are going to target because if you have like a um muscle gain or muscle enhancing supplement then you're not going to go for keto diets you're going to go for gym videos you're going to go for something that is a bit more affiliated with gyms and fitness and health instead of weight loss and it's going to be the same niche but it's going to be a little differently branched so this simple and easy google doc method basically enables you to bypass the initial setup where you get blocked from facebook or blocked from pinterest blocked from reddit you can share this on any platform and not only that you can just go into your gmail start emailing youtubers that you know uh, you can just find all youtuber emails in their descriptions or on their facebook or instagram accounts and then inbox them about your offer inbox them the link to the document and the more your document is spread the more leads you're going to generate and the best part about this is that because this document doesn't provide all the information a lot of people are just going to click on it and you're going to generate a lot more leads i'm not saying you're going to get a lot more conversion i'm saying you're going to get a lot more leads on your product and leads are eventual conversions the more leads you have the more conversions you are going to be able to generate so that was it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to promote your affiliate products using Google Docs. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comment box down below. Follow the tips to make sure you incite the most amount of curiosity out of your leads so they are more likely to buy your product. That was it for today and I will catch you guys in the next video.